Welcome to episode 100 of Ask the Skinny Guy Savior. By now, we've already answered over 500 plus questions since starting this series, and I wanna thank you for submitting them. The show wouldn't be uh, what it is without you. So what we're gonna do today, as promised on my fan page, is true or false questions. So you've asked the questions here, and I'm gonna say true or false, and I'm gonna explain why. So we've got the first question from Mo Jordan. He says, stretch marks are genetics and we can do nothing about them. True or false? This is false. Uh, a diet high in vitamin E can help with stretch marks and there's a supplement called Gotchuch Cola. Um, I'll spell that for you, write this down. G-O-T-U, Gotchu Cola. And, um, this has been shown to reduce stretch marks. The only problem is that it takes up to six months to start working. Simon Isho asks, training legs for more upper body growth, true or false? 100% true. Uh, what happens when you train large muscle groups such as your legs is you increase overall systemic uh, T levels, testosterone levels, IGF-1, and uh, growth hormone levels, which have an effect on your overall body. David Rivero, cardio after weights, question uh, mark. That's not a true or false question, so we're moving on. Simon Nisho asks another question. The more time under tension equals more growth. Absolutely. Assuming the loads are 60 to 75% of your one rep max. So just because the time under tension lasts, say, 60 seconds, if the loads are light, it doesn't apply. So the loads must be sufficient for time under tension to be effective for hypertrophy. Robert Anderson asks, true or false, protein and carbs before a workout will build muscle? True, but I prefer to have my carbohydrates about four hours before the workout, not one hour, because carbohydrates are known to increase serotonin levels, uh, which, are the, which is the neurotransmitter that you experience <laughs> after an orgasm. So <laughs> most guys who have orgasms aren't thinking about going to the gym right away, so don't time your carbohydrates too close to your workout. I prefer like four hours before, and then about an hour before more of a protein, fat-based uh, meal. Next question, Sai Yohan, compound muscle exercise is better than isolated. Ah, uh, this is tough. Um, true for intermediate and advanced lifters. So there is a time and place for isolation exercises for everybody, but especially for beginners who don't have the control to do multi-joint movements. Mitch Wan, is creatine worth buying? Uh, true, this is, uh, it's definitely worth buying. It's got more, there's more scientific literature and uh, support for this being one of the best muscle building and strength building supplements that we have available to us. One more question, this is, uh, okay, John Adamson. Um, this is, these are right off my fan page here, folks. I'm just reading them in the order they came in. God in the Christian sense exists. 100% true. Um, I believe that where there's a design, there's a designer. I believe where there's a creation, there's a creator. I believe where there's a watch, there's a watchmaker. So I 100% believe in a higher power, whether you want to call him God or the big man upstairs is your preference, but absolutely true. All right, so there's your first round, guys. Next round, we'll knock out another. I'm just refreshing the page here, and just in that last few minutes that I answered those, there was another like 15 questions that just came in. So we'll do these in about a batch of a dozen at a time. Uh, keep it around three, four minutes. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, be sure to do that. And I want to thank you for submitting these questions. It helps me sharpen my knowledge, stay on top of my game, and it helps you get results and start benefiting your life as well. Subscribe right now if you haven't done that. We'll see you on the next episode with more true and false.